Today I'm going to show you how to upload and optimize your video when it comes to that time that you want to upload it. So I've got a video ready. Um, it's basically about how to create YouTube channel. So how to create YouTube channel. Or well, there's a lot of people typing in how to create YouTube account. So let's go with how to create a YouTube channel. So I'm going to copy this and this is going to be the my main title. So the first thing you want to do, once you, you've got your title, you understand what keyword you're targeting, you want to go and click on the upload button. You want to select your video to be uploaded as private because you don't want it to start appearing for people until you have all the settings and details correct. So once you've marked it as private, select a file to upload and then select your video. So I'm going to click on creating a new channel and it will instantly start uploading. So the first thing you want to do is put in your keyword title, how to create a YouTube channel. Now what you can do is capitalize the first letter of each um, word if you like. I just like doing this, I got into the habit and I think it looks nicer. You YouTube channel and ideally you want your keyword to be as close to the beginning of the sentence as possible. The next is the description. Ideally you want to explain to your audience exactly what your video is about. Uh, you want to use keywords which are associated with your main keyword. So we saw earlier I typed in how to create a YouTube channel and we saw a couple of other related keywords and phrases like how to create a YouTube account. Um, so ideally you want a couple of other keywords which are very closely related and you also want to use your main title keyword in your channel description. So I would probably put something like how to create a YouTube channel from scratch in five minutes. Learn more great tips from your website.com and then put in a brief intro. So basically what we're doing, we're having our keyword very close to the beginning of the description. Then we're linking them to our website if they want to know, know more information. And then we're going to explain a bit more detail about what's in the video. So here you would type what's in the video. And then once you have done this, you want to put in links to all your social accounts and your main website. Links to social accounts. Links to website. And you also want to have a call to action. In fact, you want to put your call to action just after what's in the video. So the, your call to action is usually subscribe to my channel or go to my website or check out this product. Whatever it is, you need to make sure you have your call to action with the URL or a link that they can click to actually make that action take place. So subscribe to my channel for more awesome content released daily. And then you put in your link. And it's as simple as that. Okay, so next, once you have your description and your title, you want to go down to tags. Now, tags are very important. It's vital to get the right tags because this way your video will actually appear in the search results. Um, and the, the more targeted your tags, the more chance that you will actually get uh, traffic to your video, organic traffic to your video. So to do this, I actually use a tool inside Tube Tracker. Now this is a premium service, um, just because it is a lot faster than anything else on the market. So I'm going to type in YouTube channel and I'm going to select for it to extract tags from the top 20 keywords for uh, the keyword YouTube channel. So if I click on extract, um, so what you will find is there's a lot of people who put in random tags. So you want to remove all the random tags and the ones that don't make sense um, and just leave the ones which will benefit. 
So create a channel, that's perfect. Channel, new, create a YouTube channel, how to, YouTube channel created. Um, and basically, once you've got all the, the really good results, so how to make a YouTube channel without Google+, Plus, how to create channel without Google, um, YouTube create channel, how to create a YouTube channel, it basically grabs all the best tags. Then you go down to the bottom, click on copy tags, then you can head back over to your video and paste them in. Once you pasted them in, um, that's all you got to do. It's simple. It's done. Um, next, you want to wait for your video to upload. You also want to upload a custom thumbnail. Now, I'm going to show you how to do your own custom thumbnails very easily using a free service in the next video. So we'll leave that for now. And you can also share your video with anyone in your your circles on your Google Plus page. Now this is very important to use Google Plus um, because it is obviously the partner network of YouTube and Google, they're managed by the same people. It is the same company. So using Google Plus is a massive benefit if you utilize it correctly. And we're gonna talk about that in another video later. So next you want to add it to a playlist if you have any playlist. Um, a lot of channels will organize their videos into playlists so it's easy to find the content that your viewers want to watch. So say I have a, a channel on YouTube marketing, I might have a subcategory or a playlist for beginners, a playlist for more advanced people, um, a playlist for people who have never seen YouTube before or I could target it towards uh, traffic uh, video creation is completely up to you, but playlist can appear in search results. So it is a great way of having more potential of actually getting organic traffic. So I recommend that you split your videos into playlist as well. Once you're done, you just click on done. One more thing you can do is click on the advanced settings and you can actually choose to disable comments, allow people to rate your video or not rate your video use choose what kind of license if you've got a caption certificate uh, allow embedding notify subscribers enable age restriction there's there's a bunch of different options um, by default the options are very good so the majority of the time you can just leave them you will want to change your category um, so this is actually education and you might put it in business, but education is absolutely fine. Uh, you can put in a video location. Uh, this is important if you're targeting local businesses. So say you're in London in the UK or you're in New York in America, you want to actually put in your video location. And that way YouTube knows where you're coming from. They know where you're based and they're more likely to reveal your content to people from that geographic location and um, you can also put in the recording date so that's pretty much everything you can also choose if you want to allow your viewers to see your video statistics but I mean that's the most important areas to cover most of it is in the basic info your channel description your channel title and your tags and your custom thumbnail are vital to get the best results so most of your time should be spent on working out what your title is if there's people actually looking for that search term building your description using relevant keywords in your description as well as your main keyword making sure you're linked to all your social accounts and your websites and adding your thumbnails uh, some more advanced areas which we will go into another time is adding annotations and stuff like that to your video so you can actually direct people at the end of your videos to go to um, new videos that you created but we will cover that in another video. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.